Hi, it's something I just wanted to bring out to all the parents out there. Um, I've got a three-week-old baby and um, my wife and I have decided to top up with some formula. Uh, we just don't think he's getting enough uh, milk from his feed. So we popped into our local retailer and we stood there for about 15 minutes looking at all the different formulas for kids that are available and obviously you want the best for your kid. Um, so after about 15 minutes we decided upon our product. This was the product. So we got home, we read you know, how we're supposed to use it and we looked at it really carefully and we gave Oliver, this is Oliver, yep it's quite small gave Oliver his first feed and everything seemed okay and um, that was at about three o'clock four o'clock yesterday afternoon and then decided late on in the evening to do another top up with some more and that's when I grabbed the the tin and I wanted to know a little bit more you know while we were relaxing in bed with Oliver feeding him just a little bit more about this product I read absolutely everything and things that I didn't understand I was googling and so I can understand what this ingredient is what that vitamin is what that mineral is what the benefits of all these different things are so I can get a really good understanding which I did however after about 15 20 minutes of doing this um, for some reason I turned the tin upside down this is what I found it's not acceptable not acceptable at all. Um, surely the retailer should have picked this up. Um, I've got a three week old infant and I'm giving him formula. I'm putting something in his body that's expired literally a year ago, give or take. You know, as near as makes no difference. Anyway, I'm off to that retailer now. Um, it is 10 past nine on Human Rights Day. And I'm going to see two things. I'm going to see if they would swap it out, even though it's opened. My wife and I cannot find the receipt. Um, hopefully that's not going to be a major issue, because normally that is a determining factor if they will return something or not. But I looked at another retailer this morning at um, getting some formula, and they potentially have a similar problem. Um, they've got formula that is about to expire in two weeks now should that even be on the shelf um, you know surely that formula is gonna last you about two weeks and you're gonna be using it literally on the expiry date so I'm not gonna mention names of that retailer but this is the picture you can see it over here Might have to blur some of the parts out, so we don't know which retailer it is. I don't want to get them into trouble, but anyway. So stay tuned, we're going to pop into Checkers right now. All right. So that was uh, quick and painless. Um, I must congratulate the management of Checkers Hyper in Sandown Road, Cape Town. I uh, walked in there, spoke to the manager immediately, he was um, available for me straight away actually. And um, he looked at the product, apologized, walked straight to the infant formula section, called some staff over and they actually checked every single tin while I was there. Um, and it looked like I got the one expired tin on the shelf. Um, thanks guys for sorting it out and um, thanks checkers.